What is up guys? You Bakiest Black here with Solar's Finest. I know it's been a while, but uh got a pretty good video for you guys today. No, sorry about the hiatus there. Things have been still pretty hectic um in the life here. Very busy these days, working and got my cousin living with us now and babies are being babies, so you know, all that fun stuff. But anyways, today I got a pretty good video for you guys, and this is a farm everything method, pretty much. I mean, you're going to get your TP medals, you're going to get Zenny. Best of all, you're going to get a shit ton of experience. So what we do is we come to the expert mission where you fight Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. And, you know, you kind of uh, spam the shit out of him a little bit, you know, because that's what you do. And honestly, you only have, like, uh, about five minutes once you start it, so... I mean, you really don't got time to dick around. You you got to get it done quick. It usually takes me uh, two and a half minutes to get her done. As a as a Kai Blast build, I'm I'm level 90 now, and it's getting really hard to level up. So I uh, put together a method for you know just farming everything and getting a lot of experience really quick. Cause from uh, 90 to 91, you're looking at about 6.6 .6 million experience. And uh, fighting Vegeta Blue here in this expert mission, I mean, you can you can solo it easy, easily, you know. I mean, I just got computers with me. They keep them busy, and you just kind of nuke them. But anyways, as far as the experience goes, you get about, uh, depending on your rank, um, which isn't hard to Z rank at all, um, you get about, you know, 180 to 250,000 if you got the 40 ton weight on. So you definitely want to get those 40 ton weights to uh, double your experience at the end. And it, it, does, it does help out a lot. I got about, I don't know, about four or five levels yesterday just uh, doing this for uh, TT metal grinding, basically, to get my uh, Bojack gear. But here, I'll show you the exact numbers here. So it took about two minutes and 20 seconds. Beat the piss out of the computers because they suck. So yep, see so it doubles right there, 16 TP guess. medals, two and a, two, not even two and a half minutes, I mean it's, it's cake. Probably the, uh, the best method I've found so far for grinding up. And Great Ape Festival is good, but uh, we're going to talk about something else right now. So, Super Baby 2's outfit, how do you get that? Well, it kind of ties in with the whole uh, uh, grinding... Uh, Grinding essentially, you know how those minutes are only two, two and a half minutes long. Every three missions you do, your uh, booze are gonna come back from the from the Majin house after you feed them, of course. So you gotta feed them. Anyways, you just go here to your Majin Boo house, and you're gonna want the yellow Majin Boos. Those are the ones that give you the costumes. And it took me, I don't know, I got really lucky, I guess. It only took me about two, two and a half hours of doing this, you know, to get the uh, Super Baby 2 costume. I did get Supreme Kai's outfit also. I got Tabora. I got Spike the Devil Man, which is a pretty, pretty ridiculous looking suit, but it's sweet. You can also get some good Z-Souls here. The Hum 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 Z-Soul that heals your entire team over time. You get from the Red Boos. And there's the Super Baby 2's outfit. Let me go ahead and uh, put that on for you guys here in a sec, and we'll check stats and stuff. Do I grab my other dudes? And you can get a few other nifty little outfits out of here too. Basically, you just buy a bunch of fish from your item shop and just feed them. Uh, they'll change every three times you feed them, so... Alright, so here's the outfit here. Looks pretty badass. And uh, yeah, that's basically all you do. Just buy a bunch of fish, feed them a fish, then they go away for three missions. Rinse and repeat. And they'll give you a give you an option right here where it says, you know, they're going to try and transform and you can either calm them down or guard. If you guard, they're going to change colors. If they uh, if you calm them down, they stay the What's same up? color. So you can get more and more chances to get the items you want, you know, like the outfit or the uh, Z soul from the red ones. But it's, uh, it's not too bad of a grind at all, really. I mean, you can just... You don't even really have to pay attention huh? to it, you can just do it while you're uh, grinding your TP and your experience. And with uh, the new DLC coming out here on Tuesday, there might even be some new items, I don't know. 
But anyways, I'm just going to show you the stats here real quick on the armor. And then we'll, uh, we'll call it. So let's take a look here. So let's see. Looks badass as shit, by the way. So it looks like we got da, 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 health, stamina, and strike supers, which would be pretty decent for a melee build, which I'm not, so I got a QQ bang over it, but... Anyways, the outfit, the outfit is damn sick. I like it a lot. Anyways, guys, thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll catch you in our next video. Peace.